Hello, my sweet babies. How's everyone doing today? Let me tell y'all what. I done started this video I don't know how many times, and I finally just cut it off. I said, I'm just not going to do it. Because my son just kept coming in here, Mom and Mom and Mom, wear this, Mom, wear that. And I said, oh, my goodness. You know, it's like they can't see you doing something. You know what I mean? Anyway, now I've been calmed down a little bit. So, what I'm doing is... I'm making personalized Christmas ornaments, okay? And I'm using this mold. I got it off of Amazon. I do believe. I'm going to have to find it. I've had this a long time. Now, in my last video, I showed y'all that green uh, W I made. Well, this is for my mama. I did hers in green and silver. Now, I used the silver leaf pen and went over it. And I'm going to show y'all what it did. Now, this one is for Mary Bell. That's my granddaughter. She loves black, so I did hers in black and gold. She's got to have a little pop of color. You know what I mean? This is Lily. Her, she wanted purple, so I did hers in purple and gold. This is Celia's. Hers is in red and silver because she loves red. And this one is Maria. That's my youngest on my oldest daughter's children and she likes pink so I did hers in pink and gold now this is my daughter's now I haven't done it yet. now I did these the same way I told you that I done the other one the W with the glitter in the back I just poured the green in and then put that no sink glitter and gave it a spin around and it just made my letter glittery oh ain't it pretty so I'm gonna do my daughter's in silver because I think that silver and green is just pretty. Now, all you do is take your silver leaf pen. This is a chrome marker by Les Resin. And just go over your A. Now, don't worry about it if you get out of line because we're going to do that too. All the raised parts. Okay? So, now we got to get that little, little diddle in the middle. Look at that. Ain't that pretty? Now, what you want to do is just take your marker... And just slide over the top. Just slide over the top. Make sure you get your points. If you use this mold. They got little points on them. And just slide it over it. And it will get all the raised points. Look at that. Is that not pretty if I can hold it? Oh, children, I tell you. Grown children. And then, that's that. Make sure you get them all. And then there's April's. That's my oldest daughter. There it goes. Goodness, takes it forever. How pretty is that? Ooh, and it's got the glitter in the background of the letter. All right, now then, these I've had, oh, I don't know how long. I got them at. My drugstore was having a sale. Look at this doggone camera. Was having a sale, and they wanted $10 for these coasters and their cardboard. I don't even think they're cardboard. I don't really know what they are. But anyway, they marked them down to $5. Then they marked them down to 2 and then a dollar. And then Wanda Faye scooped them right on up, okay? So what I did, I took this little dabber. And I put me some white paint on it. Just like that. Okay? Now, if you dab it, it gives it texture. Now, here we go again. Let's see if it's going to do it. Now, there it goes. See? When you dab it, it makes it look like snow on there. Okay? So, just take your little dabber. <sighs> Come on, slow camera. And you just dab. Now, i got to put two coats on it, on all of them. And I dry it with my heat gun because, you know, I ain't got time to, for paint to dry. And you just dab, dab, dab. Now, you can do the edges if you want. And there you go. Do it until you don't see any of the color. Now, I did have some wood rounds 
but I just, I don't think they big enough. They just don't seem big enough. And when I do my second coat, I'm gonna do the edges, okay? So there it is. Now I'm gonna do my second coat, and I gotta go put this in some water, but anyway, I have these wood rounds, and I was gonna paint them white and just leave the edge, the, the bark, but I didn't, I don't know, I didn't like it. I mean, I guess it's cute. I guess. Mm. I don't know. I like this better because we're going to decorate it, not with glitter either. We're going to put some crushed glass on there. And I hope I got enough. I think I do. I've got this little container full. So we're going to be putting that on there. I've got green, but I, I don't. Maybe a mixture? No. I'm just going to do the clear. So that's my plan, baby. And I'm going to be using UV. Less resin. Okay. All right. I think I got y'all caught up now. I think he's out there working on his car. So maybe I'll have a little pace and quiet. And then I got these for the hangers in silver and gold. I thought those would be beautiful for the hanger. All right. I got all that out my stash. <laughs> When I get these second coated, get the second coat on them, then I'll be back, babies, and we're going to decorate, okay? All right, I got all of them second coated and uh, ready to go. So, what I'm going to do, let me move, oh, and I use System 3 acrylic white paint to paint them with, okay? I'm going to move these out of the way before my camera goes insane. Y'all see it blinking. I don't know what's wrong, but anyway, here we go. All right, now, I'm going to take this top off because I am not fighting. We're trying to squeeze it out. I'm going to put me a double in the middle, just like that, okay? Just put your little, little double in the middle. Let me, let me zoom y'all in a little bit. So y'all can see what I'm doing and make this camera go a little bit more nuts. <laughs> now I'm going to pick it up. And that's going to take too long. Let me get me uh, this here. And I'm just going to pull it to the edges. Okay. Just like that, baby dolls. Let that level out just a little, and I'm going to pop these little bubbles. Okay. All right, here's my mom's. There we go. I'm going to put hers right in the middle. Let me look in this camera and make sure it's straight. All right, and then I'm just going to take some of this. Now, I probably shouldn't have done it on a silicone mat, but you know what. Let's go. I'm going to cure this, and I'll be right back. And I'm I'm just thinking it needs something else. I'll be right back. All right, there's Mama's. I have to get my Dremel out and put a hole in this one. Um, I did get the other holes done, and I done them with my hole punch. Yeah. But I'm not liking that, y'all. It needs something else. So what I'm thinking is I'm going to take the UV resin and build these crystals up to the edge. Not out here, but just up to the edge so it will look like it's sitting in snow. Y'all know what I mean? I'm, I'm going to try it because right now I don't like it. All right, there it is. Now, it looks like it's embedded in the snow. What y'all think about that? Now, I'm going to take a green paint pen. Okay. I think it's acrylic. Yep, acrylic paint pen. And I'm going to hit these edges. And 
and there's that done in green. Now don't look at the back because I gotta paint the back. But anyway, well now let's put our little hanger on it. And I'm gonna be using this. It's wired. Okay. There's her little hanger. Just simple. I think it's a little too simple for me, y'all know. I think I need something bigger than that in there, like some ribbon. That's what I need. <laughs> so, if y'all do it, put ribbon. Don't put, don't, don't, don't put that. Don't put that. My ribbon's in the shed, in the art shed, so, and it's pouring rain. But, there it is on a big, round, wood round. It's not wood, though. I don't know what that stuff is. So, now, I want to do one. Just to show y'all the difference in a wood round and a big wood round, okay? So let's do a one on this one. And I'm just going to do the same thing. Oh, that's cute. Alright, got that cured. I did go to the art shed and get a bigger ribbon. Now this ribbon is wired. I got that Dollar Tree paddock. And it's got a green tint in going down the middle of that silver. And I just thought it would match perfect. Because it's silver and green. I love it now. I think it's pretty. And I did get some red for Celia's. Now this goes on the little wood chunk. Now this is Celia's. Since Mama is the grandma, I figured hers need to go on a big one. Don't y'all think so? And I may do April's on the big one since she's their mama. But there's Celia's. I think that's pretty. I, I, I love it. Um, I think I'm, I love Mama's the most. <laughs> I think that's my favorite. I do believe it is my favorite. All right, let's see if I can get this through here. pull it and then spread your ribbon out just like that and cut this off yeah there we go and there's Celia's so that gives y'all two ideas to do with that letter mold. You can put it on small wood round or you can put it on large. Now, I gotta finish the rest of them. I just wanted to show y'all that. And um, I'll have the mold down in the description. Y'all let me know what you think. What you think about it? I think that's my, I don't know. I love that red. But anyway, I'm finna get busy and finish the rest, and I'm leaving for my mama's Wednesday morning. And I won't be back until Thursday afternoon. Then I gotta cook Thanksgiving dinner here. And uh, so my next video will probably be Friday. I'm gonna say Friday. And um, hopefully we can have the live game night Saturday, okay? I'll let y'all know, babies. I'll put it on the community post, okay? All right. Let's get to the uh, prayer list. All right. Continue prayers for Miss Patricia Davis, Miss Christine, Miss Carol Ann Surprise, Miss Lisa Provost and her husband, Miss Brenda Levi, Miss Billy Holman and her husband, Miss Roseanne, Miss Lisa Smith, Miss Charlene, Miss Beverly. Miss Angel Ortega for a speedy recovery. Uh, Miss Stacy's mama, Miss Pat. She's having surgery December the 12th. Miss Brenda Hickerson's family. And Miss Margaret Wood's dad, Mr. Albert. Okay, darlings. All right. Let's get a prayer card. I'm excited. I couldn't believe it. I was like, I wonder if they're the same, you know, just in a different color box. Because I've never had the purple box. That'd be pretty in a journal, wouldn't it? Oh, goodness. 
All right, let me give them a little shuffle shuffle. Let me take get that off my hand. That glass cut my finger, so I had to put me a um, baby wipe on there. Good thing I had the disinfectant ones. All right, let's just get one up top. The Lord is near to all who call on him. Psalm chapter 145, verse 18. Amen. That's the truth. That is the truth, babies. All right, darlings. Y'all let me know which one you like. And I hope I've inspired y'all to get the mold and make you some personalized Christmas ornaments. How about that? All right. I'm going to try to get two more things posted before I leave Wednesday. Oh, I'm going to try. I'm going to push it. I'm going to try, honey. Might just be one, but I'm going to try for two. Okay? All right, darlings. If I don't see y'all again before Wednesday, because you never know what might happen, then y'all have a blessed Thanksgiving, darlings. And uh, I'll see y'all on the next video. Peace, love, prayers, and happiness, babies. Bye.